I am in Carolina's master bedroom and I just wanted to show you a really quick and easy art project she did. I just love it. She took some old frames that she had and she just found at the thrift store a box full of old fabric scraps and she just put them behind uh, the frames and it made a beautiful, beautiful display over her bed and it kind of matches. I'll get a little bit up close so you can see. This one, there's no glass even on the front because it's a really textured fabric and some do, depending. But even so, what a colorful way to just make a cute display above your bed. How cheap and easy would that be? Easy. I love it. Right here, she's done the same thing with the fabric and the frames and not having the glass in there. But then she's just strung some ribbon and then um, she can slip pictures underneath there if she wants, like family photos or whatnot. But Her own little decorative boards over here. Another cute and easy idea for art. Okay, this is one of my favorite ideas for an easy art display on your walls. Um, you just take old wood that you have or buy a two by four and make your own little shadow boxes. She wanted kind of the rustic look anyway, so she just painted them a brown and didn't worry about sanding. Like you can see the corners are kind of chipped or the wood's not really perfect. She wanted that rustic look. Then I'm gonna move this. She just took some scrapbooking paper that she liked and put it in the back. And they're not even like the full sheets. Like this one is like that. This one she did it more vertically. So she's kind of varied where she's put the scrapbooking paper. And then she's just put a few little, you know, trinket things for on display that she enjoys looking at. Or like a picture of her and her husband. I think that's really cute. But it's just all from, I think, two sheets of scrapbooking paper. And then if you look at it all together, if you look at it all together, it just makes a really nice wall display. Really, really pretty. I love it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on the Green Apple Home.